uh, we come now to our prayers of intercession, so let us pray. We pray for those today we know who are sick or injured, whether that be in body, mind or in spirit. In the quiet we name them before you, Lord, in our hearts. O oh Lord, bring strength, comfort and healing. Lord, speak a word of healing to those we name to you now. Rest your healing hand upon them. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. We pray for those today we know who are lonely. In the quiet we name them before you, Lord, in our hearts. Lord, let these lonely ones let them hear your voice. Call them to yourself. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Lord, we pray for the world. We pray for the war-torn areas of it. Lord, we pray for those who, are, who have suffered from flooding in this country. We pray for those whose homes have been wrecked. We pray for those whose, whose possessions have been destroyed. Lord, would you please bring them comfort in their trouble? And Lord God, we pray for the spread of the gospel. Bless those who preach, those who teach, those who lead services of worship, all who seek to speak in your name. Lord, would you open a door for our message? Cause our words to be the means of salvation in, in this society. Grant that your church may grow, that the knowledge of your love and your presence may increase all around the world and especially here. And we pray for ourselves. You called us and saved us in order to make us like your Son, our Lord Jesus Christ. Heavenly Father, would you change us day by day by the work of your Holy Spirit in us so that we may grow more like Jesus in all that we think and say and do. You have called us to be your witnesses. Help us as a church to make Jesus known to others through our words and lives, our prayers and our deeds. In his name we pray. Amen. I hope you felt able to worship the Lord and have enjoyed this service of readings, hymns and prayers today. My thanks to Chris Cousins for helping to put this service together and to our readers today. But our time here this morning is drawing to a close and before our closing hymn, a final prayer. Lord Jesus Christ, whether we be far from you in this moment, in our own cares, sorrows and concerns, 
or whether we be close to you in walking every day in your will and ways. Lord Jesus, draw us entirely to yourself. Lord, would you speak? For your servants are listening. This day and always. Amen. Our closing song is the hymn, Master Speak, Thy Servant Heareth.